A somber evening ended deadly after a 31-year-old woman was gunned down returning home from a funeral. It's not safe here. It's actually terrifying to know that you're in a neighborhood where things like this happening, right? I could be driving just today and gunshots are everywhere. Yes, it's scary. I mean, I mean, just seeing, seeing the kids around the neighborhood and seeing stuff that happened like that, it's not safe at all. Janice Naraka was shot in the chest just as she was in front of her Allen and Lawrence apartment. The shooter sped off in their Cadillac SUV. Now, police say that there was nothing in Nayako's history to suggest that she would be the target of the shooter. Police are currently investigating whether the shooter was from the area and whether they intended to target a similar-looking car. Police Chief Mark Saunders says gang violence may have reared its head. I think that our street gang subculture is an issue right now when it comes to uh, policing in the city. Nayako's death has residents fearing not only for their own lives, but their loved ones. Next time it will be me or my brother or my family, so it's really scary. The next time, yet, a reality for today's victim. Renali Anshin, CTV News, Toronto.